We're here today at White Hart Lane, and big welcome to you. Thank you for joining us. And Alan Smith is with me, Martin Tyler. Well, if you're from my vintage, Manchester United against Spurs, that was an English classic, particularly in the 1960s when Tottenham were doing so well and Manchester United rebuilt after the Munich Air tragedy. It hasn't quite had that significance recently, but it's got a bit of glamour about it, hasn't it? Well, it has. can't quite remember the 60s, Martin, like you, but uh, you think of some of the tussles and we've seen plenty of goals down the years. The last trophy Newcastle United won was back in 1969. It was a European trophy in the fledgling years of that kind of competition. Uh, it's been a barren decade after decade since, but here they come now. Well, they flew out the blocks, didn't they? And uh, to be in a Champions Cup spot, yes, it's, it's early days, but showing really good form. This is today's Tottenham Hotspur team. Hugo Lori starts in goal. Toby Aldevarel starts. He was man of the match last time out. Nabil Bentaleb starts with Deli Ali in the centre of the park. So a couple of strikers for them at the front end of the team. Just the single change for Manchester United. Sergio Romero plays in goal. Luke Shaw starts. He was man of the match last time out. Just one out and out attacker in the lineup. Our referee today is Mike D. We're underway here with Spurs kicking off. Victor Waniyama. On the attack here. Gets his foot in there. Well, this is how this team can play sustained attacking football but when they lose it as they've done now here's Shaw Blint well, a strong character in the Manchester United lineup and a strong competitor as well well some strikers place them but uh, this lad can place them and place them with power that's a good spot by the defender Trying to find an opening, not panicking. Damia intercepted well. Good challenge. Here's Bentaleb. Janssen. Good interception. Villa James McCarthy Toby Alderweireld made sure the ball is stuck at his foot a timely challenge let in the shot go oh a good goal and now they're a goal to the good he took the chance with Absolute precision, Alan. Wasn't an easy one either, that Martin, but he made it look so. So the first goal, it's 1 0. Victor Waniyama. Davis. Here's Bentaleb.
advantage rule played for Spurs. Here's a chance to attack. Well, they look promising there in that wide area, but the defender's done well. Now Anthony Martial. Shaw. Presented possession to the opposition now. Referee's pointed for a goal kick. Ooh, just worried about the rain only in that it's uh, impairing a bit our visibility of the proceedings out there on the pitch. Yeah, well, nice and dry up here, but uh, unlike the players, uh, who will be pretty wet after five minutes. Sure. In quickly. Referee says play on and gives Manchester United the advantage. Victor Waniyama. Well, we could get some news on the injury. I think Jeff Shreves is on the case. Foul there by the United player. Alan, this was the goal that gave them the lead. Your thoughts? Beautiful strike, drilled it and overly into the bottom right-hand corner there. Free kick for Manchester United. Well, they usually get their man, Real Madrid, and that's certainly the case this time. Well, it's a fairly big transfer figure, £40 million pounds or thereabouts, and uh, I think this lad won't be affected by it, though. He'll uh, be able to concentrate on his football and show us what he can do. Attacking well here. There's the ball in. Defender to it first. Chris Smalling, return pass. Umvila. On to the attack now. Quick tempo to the passing. The opposition can't get near them. The shot's on! Not quite this time. Scored already, of course. I did fancy him in that position, I've got to say, having taken his earlier goal so well. Sure. Now Anthony Martial. James McCarthy. And we're hearing there will be three added minutes here. Three minutes. Dele Alli. Here's Alley. Well, that's half time at 1-0. Well, the player that we're featuring here has done well. He's certainly been an influence on this first half. Well, he played really well, didn't he? And he got himself a goal to put his team ahead. He'll be pleased with that first 45 minutes. They decided to make a change. And being behind, you can understand that. Coming onto the pitch, number 30, Manchester United with the second half now underway and they are leading. Chris Smalling. Damian. McCarthy. It's a good place to win the ball here. Manchester United moving into the attack. He's read that, hasn't he, and made the interception, made it look easy, actually. On EA Sports, very soon for you, the Champions Cup fixture. Spurs, they'll be hosting Fiorentina. Yeah, high-quality fixture, this one. There won't be much quarter given. Tottenham have got a corner now. And some movement from the Manchester United bench. There's going to be a substitution now.
of the world. Super header, narrowly wide. Yeah, the goalie was rooted to the spot there. against Spurs substitution for Manchester United Manchester United want to make a change now time wasting Alan do you think from the away team here they've got to win perhaps uh, in their sights now if they do well but there are other ways of seeing it through from here yeah well you can understand it to us that's an infringement by Manchester United. <laughs> Moving. And the referee's given the free kick. If they go in, of course, everybody goes, oh, wow, what a great decision. If they don't... Well, it's one in a hundred, that, isn't it? And uh, I don't think this player is the sort capable of finding the back of the net from that distance. Safety first there. Victor Waniyama, Danny Rose, he can lay it off to the supporting player. And in goes the cross. Cross is blocked here. Deflected behind, a clear corner. Well, there's still time to hit back in this game, and they're going to try and do it with a substitute. Goes for it with a fist. goes in attacking well here Deli Alec probing away trying to find room for a shot maybe that's cut out Toby Alderweireld he's coming forward with some danger. Oh, he showed great anticipation there. He's had a go here. And the goalkeeper got across to it. And that's a corner for Tottenham. got the possession stats so far for you coming up on the screen well nothing to split the two sides this is when you're looking for somebody to pick out a hole great pass great the goal here's McCarthy That's good support play from his teammates Davis What can Tottenham do now in these closing stages? Well, the manager on the sidelines, waving his centre-halves forward. It could be boot one stuff now. And there's the interception. Attack building for... Great chance! Oh, great work by the keeper. Corner for Manchester United. Punched away by the goalkeeper. It's a good way to nick the ball back. Quick thinking. 
10 minutes left of regular time. Toby Alderweireld. It's Eric Dyer. It's Tottenham who are going to make the change. Just to remind you of the scoreline, Manchester United a goal to the good. Here's Martial. Well, this attack, we oh, could be in. Well, given the stage of the match, that was an important intervention there to stop that counter-attack. A timely challenge. Davis. Time is ticking away here. Four minutes to go. Pogba. Good vision to be able to switch the play there. Well read by the defender. The number's gone up as far as added time is concerned. It's four. Yeah, a little murmur goes around the crowd because enough time for me to get an equaliser, maybe even a winner here. That's going to run on through to the goalkeeper. Quickly. There's the final whistle, and it's a win here for Manchester United. It's been a rock of a defensive performance today. It has. They've come under an awful amount of pressure, and you take a great deal of satisfaction from that as a defender. Well, I think he was the best performer in a good team today. Oh, lots of energy, lots of quality, and a good goal, along with plenty of chances. Aston Villa 2, West Ham United 2.